Thanks for watching Baseball Tips with Coach Avery. If you're wondering why I'm acting a little funny, I'm photobombing. Now, you ask, why the heck is he photobombing in his own video? Well, I'm photobombing to hit bombs. And what you might notice when people photobomb is they lean over and they lean back and they get right in between their two friends and try and ruin the photo. Well, I'm trying to ruin the ball. Now, I'm going to explain why this photo bombing is so important. When we're hitting, we're in a position where we want to be over the baseball and we want to be in a position to turn through and extend our arms out and extend and watch that ball fly, 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 till it's out of the picture. Now, I'm going to put a ball on the tee here. And what I really mean is a lot of people are confused by what tilt and turn is. Tilt, shoulders, okay? Turn, body, okay? So hitting's a combination of both, but it happens in a bit over position. Why is this position so important? It keeps you over the plate. The ball is on this side of your body. It is not over here. So when you see guys and they're swinging for the fences and they lean back, which is just tilt, my shoulder has not opened at all, they are not really keeping their body over the plate, over where the ball is coming. Therefore, they're releasing their energy behind them. So when I'm thinking about photo bombing, what do I do? I tilt myself in the picture and then I open up so you can see me. We want to turn and remain with this side tilt that helps us cover the plate and then we extend out. Therefore, when we hit, we want to get in a nice position where we set up, we stride, we turn, and we photo bomb. Thanks for watching Baseball Tips with Coach Avery. I'll see you next time.